Hello everyone, and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. After son Evans' leukemia diagnosis, Don Taylor and Billy Fletcher have experienced a terrifying few weeks. It tests them individually and as a family. It tests them as a pair. When Don, who was scared, saw that the infant had numerous bruises, a diagnosis was made. Don made the decision to stay in the hospital with Evan after the doctor informed them that Evan needed to begin treatment right away. This caused a great deal of stress for both her and Billy. She started to feel angry that he was able to leave the hospital and resume his usual life and he felt the same way about her being able to stay with Evan while he had to go back home and support their family. They have had to relearn how to communicate because it has been a difficult period for them both. However, there have been other hiccups along the way. For example, Don's desire to make the pain go away caused Will, Dean Andrews, to worry that she would revert to drug use. Don's birth mother, Rose, Christine Tremico, tries clumsily to assist her by giving sleeping medication to a recovering addict. Naturally, we are aware that Rose is only there to bed Will and ruin Kim's life in order to further Ruby's agenda. There will eventually be more terrible news for Dawn as a result. However, there is some positive news coming soon. Evan the baby is well enough to return home. His parents are ecstatic to be able to bring the toddler back to home farm. And this is exactly what the family has been waiting for. Dawn is growing extremely anxious around her son, terrified that she will unintentionally infect him and cause his death. Things got so bad that she can't even hug her other children for fear of spreading the germs. It appears that Dawn has a new struggle ahead of her. What does her future hold? Sam Hall, an Emmerdale star, has responded to rumors that he may be leaving the show, following suggestions that his character would die after 18 years. In the ITV serial opera, the actor is best known for portraying Samson Dingle, a character born in 2006 to Sam Dingle and Alice Wilson. However, when Alice's cancer, which she was diagnosed with while pregnant, worsened, it was tragic for the baby. The Dingles were shocked to learn that Sam's brother, Kane Dingle, assumed responsibility for giving Alice the lethal amount of morphine six months after Samson's birth in order to save Samson from losing both of his parents. Samson received the all-clear after receiving a meningitis diagnosis the next year. Other major plot points. Following a one-night encounter earlier in the year, Amelia Spencer gave birth to Samson's daughter a third in October 2022, making him a father at the age of 16. However, Sam was the fourth actor to play Samson in The Dales since he debuted in the part at the age of five. The last month, there were rumors that Samson would be killed off and that Sam would be departing the program. Nevertheless, Sam has refuted the rumors and stated that he will be sharing good stories about himself and his long-running character in a recent interview with Inside Soap magazine. He told the outlet, Well, I don't want to give too much away, but Samson has some big stuff coming up. But don't worry, he's most definitely not going to disappear. I was thrilled to see the scripts and knew he had some exciting things ahead of him. Sam quipped that he loves playing the more disturbed side of the youngster and acknowledged that he had never held a baby before on screen daughter, Esther was introduced, even though viewers weren't fond of Samson's nasty remarks. I like playing mean Samson, but I think his good side always shines through, the actress who plays Samson stated. Like with the baby storyline, he was worried about Amelia being okay for Esther because Samson had clearly lost his mother and he didn't want his child to grow up without a mother, he went on. He may so become enraged, but ultimately, his objectives are always the right ones. In the end, he was just a young, confused adolescent who had no idea that he would be having a child so soon. Furthermore, it was the first time I had ever touched a newborn in real life. 
Samson Dingle from Emmerdale will receive a stabbing in an unexpected new plot. In several pivotal scenes that will appear on the ITV soap opera, Samson Dingle was stabbed following a confrontation between Maddie and Josh, a newcomer. Despite knowing that Amy was married to Maddie, Josh had been making out with her. In dramatic circumstances, a fight broke out over him taking the alcohol, and Samson was inadvertently stabbed. When Josh pushes him, Samson lurches forward and gets stabbed. Will he survive? And is actor Sam Hall quitting the soap opera after playing Samson for more than 15 years? Speaking of the upcoming scenes, he cautioned that there might be some huge ones, but reaffirmed that he wouldn't be eliminated. He remarked, Well, Samson has some really big stuff coming up, and I don't want to give too much away. Rest certain that he is not going to disappear. I was thrilled to see the scripts and knew he had some great things ahead of him. Although I enjoy portraying Samson as cruel, I believe that his good side always comes through. Similar to the baby tale, he was concerned about Amelia's well-being for his third because he didn't want his child to grow up without a mother and Samson had clearly lost his mother. He continued, talking about his character's past. So, he can get angry, but ultimately, his motives are always right. He was ultimately just a bewildered young adolescent who hadn't actually planned to become a parent so soon. Sam had been devastated, according to a prior source, by the news that he was going to be axed. Earlier this month, Sam's supervisors presented the news to him during a meeting. It has destroyed him, an insider revealed. He's grown up with his on-screen Dingle clan, and they are all very protective of him. There were a lot of irate Dingles in the building as word of his exing spread. There won't be a way back for him either because they intend to murder him off. He's completely destroyed. Although I enjoy portraying Samson as cruel, I believe that his good side always comes through. Similar to the baby tale, he was concerned about Amelia's well-being for his third because he didn't want his child to grow up without a mother and Samson had clearly lost his mother. He continued, talking about his character's past. So, he can get angry, but ultimately, his motives are always right. He was ultimately just a bewildered young adolescent who hadn't actually planned to become a parent so soon. Sam had been devastated according to a prior source, by the news that he was going to be axed. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.